Welcome to Imperium Galactic Survival Alpha 11.5 and in this part what I want to do is get down on the swamp planet that we came to in the last part and check out the monastery but first I want to show you something that I've been doing up here and this is at the suggestion of a comment from Terry Beer and he says that he's actually used this SV in his playthroughs and what he's done is added some extra thrusters and that's exactly what I've done to here I've added a small thruster on this side which hopefully will give me a little bit more lateral control and I've also on his suggestion added a couple of thrusters uh, to give me a bit more braking effect I'm, I'm pretty sure he said he put them between the rocket launchers I've actually gone for uh, to put them just below mainly partly out of accident to be honest so that is the change that I've put onto the ship and we want to get straight in hopefully that will improve the overall performance what we're going to do now is uh, get my brain in gear to start with. We've got thrusters on because I've been messing about. Put the shields back on because we're going to need that. And what we're going to do now is we're going to head down onto the planet. Of course, it's going to take us a little while to get there, but well, it doesn't make that much difference. Now, I don't know where we're going to come down on the planet, so we may have to do a little bit of exploring before we get to the monastery. I certainly want to take that monastery down in this video because I'm very intrigued with it because I've, as far as I can remember, I've never done a monastery. Uh, it looks like we're coming smack bang down on Xerox territory. Oh, we're actually a little bit up to the west of of the area. Actually, just drop down first. We can give us an opportunity to test out the changes to see whether the overall performance of the ship has improved because by nature this is a murky planet the lateral thrusters still aren't particularly that good it's probably marginally better but nothing spectacular well I mean I could boost up and put extra thrusters on but I think we're just we're just gonna go with what we got at the moment and we've obviously got to find the monastery. So I'm just going to set the waypoint. You can also see here where I did a bit of exploring off camera. Came down here, found the Talon area. While we're flying towards the monastery, I want to talk about uh, something that was I found quite interesting. That is, Spange did a video couple of days ago or was it yesterday I can't remember now I've been doing so much recently um, where he listed 10 uh, uh, blueprints which are very useful for CPU now I'm not going to say that I agree completely with his choice of blueprints uh, although some of them are exceptionally good especially the artwork and presentation but I have to admit watching his video has given me some intriguing ideas especially with respect to capital vessels and having this composite um, capital vessel base I suppose is probably the best way to describe it where you've got different components all docked together to form a single cohesive ship and if you've been following my series you'll be aware that I've often talked about building an orbital base and looking at those some of those uh, capital vessels that he highlighted I kind of a bit of intrigued over I think we can get rid of that landmark now it's in the way oh so we've got some, we've got some drones hanging around as well two drones having these uh, kind of composite uh, capital vessels that all dock together to form a single one so what I mean what I'm getting at is that it's, it's given me so much to think about and the people who have actually come up with these ideas as well I mean and if you haven't seen the video I certainly recommend checking it out simply because ah, here comes a drone in oh, I have to beat him up also means we're gonna get a capital vessel out wow, there's another three over there as well I think we'll try and lure them towards us so that we can get a grouping so we can loot them together yeah and it's given me so many ideas and I think this is one of the factors with when you watch videos like Spange made that it it does just fire the imagination and 
I probably won't do it in this playthrough. Although, to be honest, if you're doing the Eden project, having a, a composite capital vessel would be very useful because then you wouldn't have to worry about a base. Maybe when Alpha 12 comes out. Anyway, we'll see how it goes. Right, we've now taken out four of these four uh, drones. I certainly want to loot those. And just go and grab them. And I, can I get you? Yep. Some more cobalt alloy and another one there, right on the limit. But we, I'm sure we can get him. So we've got that one, that one, that one. There should be four of them. I can't see the fourth one. Okay, where's the fourth one? Got those, that one there, that one there. There's the, there's the other one over there. Now, I'm going to be completely honest, I've never done a monastery and <laughs> I'm a little bit nervous about it because it is a level 5 and it means that even if it's got the usual welcoming committee it will still be fairly, uh, how can you say, contested. This is, actually I should have uh, I'll just put the, get the container controller uh, now my instinct is to wait for the troop ship to come in before we go into this area and next thing we need to do is find the way in that doesn't look like it there's got to be a door on this thing somewhere maybe it's around the front here Ah, uh, this looks a bit more promising. Well, we might as well go and knock on the front door. That will great, we've got plant creatures around as well. Now we got one over there. So we have to get... up. Oh, so here comes the... Um, have you already dropped off? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> oh well. Now the downside of this is that having to go in and loot him means that I'm going to have to wake up all the local residents inside. But we're going to go. Okay, we'll take that. Seeing we're so close in, I might as well have a look to see. There's nothing on the roof here. Uh, of course. Yeah, that's definitely the entrance there, so. And back to here. Don't have that much in the way of missiles as well. I should have to go make some more later on for the next part. And we'll do it this way. Sometimes it's easier to do it first person. Hello. Knock, knock. Nobody can. Oh. Okay, we got some. Okay, we got screaming abdams here. Hey, get off my ship. Where's that? Uh, where is he? That was quick. Oh, that was a bit risky. I think what we'll do is we'll just have a look see inside. Right. Got the door there. Got um turret up. Okay, I'm gonna get stroppy.
reload right behind this door. Hey. We got them all. Uh, a bit worried about traps and things. Right, they're behind the door there. I think what we'll do is uh, take your credit card and hello take the sandwich get this as well um right there's a spawn point there do a reload Walking over here, it's just some oops, <laughs> traps. Okay, right, we got nah, uh, and G, and that, and that. Okay, so we've got a top floor here with a couple of doors there. So we've got a door that way and door that way. Let's, let's just transfer some of this stuff to here. Um, 106, yeah, I think read the sandwich, put that in there. And we'll keep the ammunition just for the moment. Oops, no, I need the explosives because we're gonna have to blow our way through this door wait i can hear mr S where are you there you are i don't want you I don't want you creeping up on me Suppose if we go this way first. Oh no, nope, opens automatically. Okay, back to here. Aha! Gotcha. Reload. Right in the face. And. Look, see, right, there's one of them back here with a door down. Okay. Uh -huh. Um, we'll go long range. from another faction I've got fuel tanks here what we've we got in here oh well we'll just pick it up as we go uh, coffee are we still in range of our ship yep well, we don't need that got to keep an eye on the radar okay the rain's coming through the roof hey your roof leaks Right, we've got a room here. Uh, oh, we've got screaming ab dabs. We've got you. We've got you. Ah. Okay, one thing I haven't done is uh, go to uh, uh, cargo box three 
and hopefully we'll make a core. Knock that out. Wow. Didn't realise my health had got so low. How come they got some... Oh, this is a level 5, isn't it? Yeah. <laughs> Sorry about that. That's my fail. Yeah, you've got to watch level 5. They've got a lot more punch. Okay, you're still building that. Okay. Well, we don't need it just yet. Actually. Shotgun. Um, sniper rifle. Reload. Something coming in. Let's get back up here. Looks like we might have drones coming back in again. So, up here. And we'll just give the weather's coming in. Right there. Wow. Hey, cut it out. Why, is, why can't I kill him? Ow. Right, we've got a, another transport ship coming in or something. Why am I taking? Oh, that's because the shield is recharging. Hopefully we will not have taken too much damage. Okay, let's just... Uh, grab that. Okay. So we quick damage check, make sure nothing's happened. Cargo box. Okay. Oh, we're looking good, I think. I'm just going to wait for the transport to come in. What we will do is pop a couple of bandages and I think if I go to my survival constructor I've got some berry juice. Okay, here it comes. Oops. Oh. Right, something is Oh, he's got in. Never mind. Oh. <laughs> did he get a chance to put down any troops? I don't think he did. Okay, let's just level off. Over here. Right, let's just land. Thrusters off again. Uh, actually, manage fuel. Uh, get into there. Talon. Uh, cargo box three. I think we're going to leave the. Go away. Uh, I'm just going to grab the transport. Not that much in there. And back to the business in hand. Oops. Huh. Um. Yeah. 
Yeah, I can hear you. Quick reload. Right, there's an armored door there. Okay, looks like we're going through the armored door here. Use a little bit of explosive. Oops, taka. Oh. I've dropped my gun. Okay. I have to get go up close up and personal. the core. Let's have a quick look see here. Uh, I will take that. I was expecting the core to be in here. There it is. Uh, nearly missed it. I'm so busy looking down I should have been looking up. Um, what I'm going to do is put that in there. We've now got control of the base. Doesn't mean everything around here is friendly, so we're just gonna have to have a quick look at what we got. We've got eight cargo boxes, a couple of ammunition boxes. Yeah, uh, we'll take that. Yeah, we're looking at it. Uh, small ammo box one. Uh, probably not the best place to do this. I'd say this is a pretty straightforward. POI, uh, although level 5 made it a little bit interesting. Does this take me? Okay. Oh, we've got O2 tanks in here. Um, right, let's start the process. Oops. Got the, uh, I know what I have and have not taken. These are the cargo boxes. I won't have to worry about those. Keep an eye out for right. Not sure why that's got a hole there. Controller. Um, let's do it this way. What we got here? Tier two shotgun. Take that. And can hear still hear somebody operating around here. Oi! Hey, creepy! Where did you come from? Wow! Oh, wow! What wow, were we? Oh, wow. <laughs> Brief moment then, I thought I'd drop down into a a new area. Ah. You can always rely on this game to give you a bit of a heart attack. <laughs> right, I, I think we can do... Where was that trap then? Ooh, that was nasty. If I... I mean, I'm lucky I went this way. If I'd stepped fallen off this ramp, I would have fallen down into there, and we would have been in trouble. Right, I think what we're going to do is I'm just going to. Right, can I sit in my ship and. I can F4 this now. Ah, uh, let me. Uh, well, we'll put uh, 
as well empty this some of this stuff out first and then put this in the container controller and to jump out here straight at you sentry gun sentry gun we've done the ammo boxes Cargo box four. Uh, doesn't look like this is going to be particularly that profitable, but never mind. We will take it. Uh, five. Uh, off. Bridge, we'll take that. One. And we've done the ammo boxes. Now, there could be some hidden stuff in here, so the only surefire way of doing this is to... Uh, we'll need to double tap so that we don't get ambushed. And what we're going to do is... Break this, I don't... And what we're going to do is... Oops. What we'll do is we'll strip the base down. There we are, look at that. So that's actually above the door there. Hidden away, but we found them. Thank you. Oh, we'll definitely take that. And of course, because I looted it, I do it this way. If I'd come back up here, I would have run into that one. There's the other one. And we'll take that. Actually, while I'm thinking about it, what we will take is the oxygen. Uh, how much oxygen we got? One, five, two, two. And um, we'll certainly take the fuel as well. 683. Okay, slow. Still no hostiles coming in. Um. Oops. Right, still got the link. And I'm just going to press that. Double tap just to make sure around what we got here we've got a fuel tank up here that's a tier one we'll take it anyway uh, got another fuel tank here ah and another one and another one and take the what we're after is anything that will uh, is got a value on it what we got here okay we've got wow didn't spot that Although, to be honest, what that is doing inside a monastery, I don't know. I'm just going to queue up. Uh, lots of medication. And grab you. And you. And you. Got here, rifle upgrade kit. Yep. It'd be useful. And, right, that means that these should have something in it. And this one. Drop container. Oops. All good stuff that we can sell off. Look at that. Right, and another container. And we'll just take that. Break down the medical stuff. It's all good for electronics. 
an eye on the rules. I mean, we can make most of this stuff. We don't really need to pull it back out as a solid object. So we can just pull this out. What have we got here? A holographic screen. I think I will take retrieve that. Nope. there this is underground whoops and some more here we'll take this we've got here the ammo boxes whoops okay what's behind here then this is interesting or did I just miss one of the ammo boxes yeah. right, this is ground level Carbon substrate, we'll take the doors. Yeah. What have we got up here? Got a ventilator. Uh, nothing else here. Looks like the uh, Xerox have given up on us. And I think that's about it. I can't see much else left in here. I mean, we could literally go keep going around picking up. Oops, it's a light there. We'll take that. I mean, everything else here seems to be kind of just, just whoops. Ha. What's that there? There's a light. We'll take that. Okay, we'll take the lights from here. That's all optical fibers. Uh, cement. <laughs> I really have a pressing need for cement. I think we can take the core out now. I think we've basically wow, okay. Nearly missed one above the core. And I'm sure that maybe some of you are already starting to say it's behind you. Alright, so we actually got four health packs. I'm just gonna come up here. Right, let's make sure we got get that ventilator. And we got another light there. Ah, oh, I nearly missed the generator. Hello? Are you trapped in here, are you? Oh, aren't you? You're a bit sad, aren't you? Ah, he was the guy behind the door. Haha. <laughs> question is, do we go in and put him out of his misery? Uh, I suppose I could. Although, oh, there's a chance I might fall through the floor. No, we'll, we'll just leave him in charge of his wreck. And I think we've got about everything we can do from here. So I'm a bit weighted down, so we'll just go in the tradesman's entrance. And we've now wiped out the Xerox from this position here. And actually. Let's just get devices, lights, put the lights on. I haven't really tried out the light lights situation on this ship. And I think just to wind this up, we're gonna do a little bit more exploration this way. And see what we can find. Yeah, we're just gonna fly down to here just to see. Open up a bit of the planet and just wind the video up. So I'm not gonna do anything else. If we find anything of interest, that would be done in another video. Welcome back, and what we've done is we've flown into some Xerox territory here. So just to finish off, we're going to fly across here and see what we find. We're going to do a high-level flyover, rely on the shields a little bit, and a defense sector, two defense sectors, and drone. we found the drone base, the drone base, and a whole swarm of drones uh, who are already attacking us. Let's get out of here ASAP. But this is where I'm going to leave it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you found it interesting. And until next time, whatever you do, enjoy your gaming.